Hi everyone, it's the Nanny Bee 11 and I'm here on this Monday evening with Amber on the eve of the deadline for me to send out my um, travelogues journal uh, to Regina. It's due to be sent out tomorrow, which is the 25th. And I was really, really lucky. I guess I was thinking ahead for once. And I got a lot of this done um, well before I went into the hospital because I would have lost a lot of time. So um, I've, I've been working on it off and on um, the past couple of days just to finish it up. And it will be going in the mail tomorrow. And um, my theme for my travelogue journal is my favorite things and how I create with them. And I made a challenge to myself this year to use up a lot of the things that I have in my stash. And it's considerable. So um, I really wanted to do that. I have some beautiful papers and some nice embellishments. So I wanted to use those all up. So a lot of my favorite things are, of course, Tim Holtz, Graphic 45, Vintage Buttons, Flowers, Pearls, Lace, um, all kinds of things that I just really love, vintage ephemera. So I put it together in this book, and I um, I have it bound together. I'm not exactly sure how I will finish binding it, but I have two binder rings. Um, this was originally um, a bow bunny bare naked binder, and I ended up not using the binder itself because I thought it would be a little restrictive. But um, these are the pages. They're six by six pages. And I put just a couple of little ribbons on just so it wouldn't start its journey without any clothes on. And um, as you can see on the cover, I used um, Tim Holtz and some of my vintage ephemera, my little, um, my little uh, typewriter keys and buttons and a Tim Holtz knob and some of my, um, some of my papers and wild orchid uh, roses and some of my beautiful laces that I've collected um, over time. So this is the cover, and you open it up. And this is the um, this is the welcome page, and I I made um, a, a, a pocket of a transparency pocket, and I made a little book, um, and I'll show you the book. It's um, it opens up, and I've handwritten it to welcome the ladies, and it says, "Dear friends, I feel so very honored to have each of you create a special work of art for my travelogues journal. I would like each of you to feel free to create your own unique and expressive contribution to my journal. Most of all, I want you to enjoy this special journey. I love to create art using many things that I love. I'd love for you each to create using the things you love to create with. Use your very favorite things. This is the theme. My favorite things and what I would like to create with them. Please make a two-page spread using your creative elements. Make them your own in your own style, color, and design. Please include a pocket or tag with a small photo of where you love to create. You can even include a photo of you. There are no rules. Just have fun creating. And then, then I go on to say, finally, I am including tags on the last page for you to autograph for, uh, for me with a short sentiment about what inspired you to join the Travelogues Journal. Um, thank you all for creating in my journal. Sincerely, and Maureen Bergman. And then I list some of my favorite things, pearls, old lace, all kinds of little things that I thought people would enjoy. And I used a really pretty old um, element that I, a, a, sort of an advertising element that I love. And then this is just my sign-in sh sheet. I kept it kind of simple. And I have a pretty little transparency of a little girl sitting at a desk writing in her journal. And I, I'm the first one here. And I have it listed for seven, but I understand there's only going to be six of us in our group. So um, that's okay. Now, this is my spread. And I used a lot of things that I just adore. Graphic 45 paper. Um, this, is, um, this is a rose from my friend um, um, Mary at Odonata Creations. Some Tim Holtz things. Tattered Angels. One of my favorite dress form stamps pearls, um, vintage lace. And over here is a quote, all that we love deeply becomes a part of us. And that is from Helen Keller. It's one of my favorite quotes. And then my initial M, 
butterfly and a beautiful flower and then some more dress forms and then here is my tag um, with a vintage button and a pretty um, element um, from Graphic 45, Le Romantique Collection. And then I have a little photograph on here of my um, little creative studio that was done in sepia. So that this is my layout. And then these are the pages for all the ladies. They can take out their pages and work on them as they like. They just have to undo the binder clips. And then here in the back is my pocket page. And I just asked them, I included all these little tags, and in the back I, I said, just so I never forget, please take a tag and embellish it at your wish to, to personalize it. Perhaps you might use an initial. Please sign it and tell me something about what the travelogue experience has meant to you. And then that's the last page. And then I did not do my back page. I'm going to leave that blank until I receive it back, and then I'll do something. And I included my address on the back, just in case anything happens. And for now, I just have a Tim Holtz hitch post, and I just have it um, put on the knob to keep it together. So that's my travel journal, and I will be sending that out. And then included with each travel journal, I'm going. I'm working on this this evening. I'm going to be making um, a vintage postcard for all the ladies that are in my swap, and I'll personalize each one as a little gift from me um, for being in the swap with me. So it's going on its journey, and I look forward to getting all of my um, the, my books back so that I can work in them. Thanks, everybody. Say good night, Amber. Night. <laughs> Bye. Bye.